Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this procedure safely. In this video, we will show one or more of these icons. To alert you when to use caution, before you replace the fuel supply line in your leaf blower, make sure the engine has cooled and the on-off switch is in the off position. We recommend performing this procedure with little or no fuel in the tank. Note the orientation of the fuel lines attached to the carburetor, then detach them. If necessary, pull the vent line free. Now use a large flathead screwdriver to help pry the grommet out of the fuel tank and pull the fuel line assembly free. Remove the filter fuel line fitting from the fuel supply line and pull the old supply line from the grommet. Install the new fuel supply line by inserting it through the grommet. Insert the filter fuel line fitting into the supply line and push the assembly into the grommet. Now insert the fuel filter and line into the tank. Note the orientation of the fuel lines, then press the grommet into place. Attach the fuel lines to the appropriate ports on the carburetor. Position the vent line in the blower housing. With the repair complete, turn the on-off switch to the on position. Refill the fuel tank and your leaf blower should be ready for use.